to my channel if you're new my name is Nicole if you're old welcome back and today I have for you a big old haul this thick of bag uh from my goodies goodies is sort of like um it's owned by Peebles and Bialz and whatever um now it's a, like a smaller department store smaller than a Belk and Dillers but carries the same things and kind of set the same way anyway the one in my town is going out of business you know COVID hit them hard. I think they were just going to remodel into their new branded store, whatever it's called now. But yeah, anyway, so they have major discounts. I think they're on their last few days because let's see, Friday it was eight days left. So they probably only have till Friday this week and they're selling everything fixtures. They hardly had anything left. They had mostly some misses, a few juniors scattered throughout, very few girl and boy and then like men's mostly men's parts and then some shoes barely any shoes some home goods but but I hauled pretty good and um it's a amazing haul actually so I do have my receipt in here so I can tell you exactly what I paid uh if you're interested on my eyes it's the BH Cosmetics Fusion Festival palette on my lip is from Glamlight Cosmetics. This doesn't have a, any kind of identifier on it. It was with the um, release during the paint set, the paint palette set. I think these lipsticks went with it, so it was one of them. I want to say maybe just orchid or something, but that's what color it is. So, in case you're interested in it. these, I'm so excited for. I saw like one, I saw a second one, I was like, ooh. Please tell me that they have the third niece's initial, like my older teenage and 20 something year old niece. So excited because I flipped one back and there it was. So these are little wristlets. They're not makeup bags, they're actually, you know, wristlets to go out in. So we have an L for Lindsay. There was an S for Selena. And she's the 20 something year old. And then this one for Alyssa. Because, and I, this one's the only one that's different because um, it's carry-on but this was the only one they had left anyway like they had no others the rest were wristlets and they had very few of them these were all originally twenty dollars which is not bad for a nice like I don't know if it's leather faux leather and it's kind of Christmassy but it's also kind of Alabama y just flannel anyway I just thought it was cute and I love how hers has like all these separate pockets so she'll probably like better like throw her phone in there and wallet probably um so I just like that one. The wristlets are nicely sized. I mean, I don't think what she could fit in there. So anyway, so these are all, you know, $20. What it was was um, everything was basically 70 to 90% off. It just depends on what it was. And then the more you bought, if you bought five or more, you got an extra 30% off where you're supposed to. I'll come back to the, you're supposed to. So these all were $20. And then 70% off, which took off $14.01, got 30% off. And then I guess the cashier noticed that the home goods that I got weren't doing the 30% off for whatever reason. But she had a 10% off code, so she added that in. Or maybe she was just doing that for, to be nice. So it took off, the 30% took off $1.80. The 10% took off $0.42. Cents. So the final price for each of these was $3.77. I was like, and they're like brand new. I don't remember seeing them. And they hadn't been too long. Right before COVID, I was probably in there. Okay, the next thing is, this is supposed to be a size 5. But I know this looks, I know sleepers like tend to look a little bit bigger. But this one looks way bigger. This one looks like it would fit a 7, 8. Which is fine because sleepers 1 tend to shrink a little bit. And Natalie is growing. She's in a 5'6 now, so I don't think she'll have any problem. But this really looks like the height of a 7, 8 year old. Um, and I know that part of that is because it is a sleeper. But this is a uh, size 5 from Cargo's. Look how cute it is. Um, 
but legit like it looks so, it's so long like this which is good it shrinks she can wear it she can wear it for a year um but i thought it was so cute so this one was even marked down i'm thinking somebody might, might have returned it right before covid or something uh, because that would have been in March, you know, somebody was returning something from Christmas. So, um, cause this is definitely like a Christmas one. The big little heart. Love it. Uh, so $30. Can't be, will not believe it. Okay. Let me find where this was at. Right here. Okay. Heart sleeper. Original $30. 90% off. Took off $27.01. Okay. So that's $2.99, right? 30% off took off 89 cents. The extra 10 took off 21%. My final price for this brand new sleeper. So cute from Carter's. $1.89. Can you believe that? $1.89. This is so good because I, you know, we weren't able to, they didn't have any extra like pajama sets for them last Black Friday because we normally stock up for the following year. So, um, but I had one extra and a 6-7 that Colton's getting because it's Black Panther. He's just going to get the Black Panther one, but a dollar eighty nine, and it's so cute and soft. And I just love it. So, yeah, that Queensland gets the bonus. I was so excited about the price of that. I'm hoping this is a Mrs. But I'm thinking it might actually be a Junior's department because I got a small. But I was hoping to get this for my niece who wears the medium, the older one. Um, she's kind of a smaller medium in Junior's, so. I I think this should fit. I might get her to try it just to be sure. It's made a little loose anyway, but it's like a kimono romper. Yes, a romper. Isn't that a gorgeous print? I loved it. They had quite a few of these, but I love this blue color. They had like a, a reddish color. I'm not sure about the brand because it almost looks size like a smaller women's, which about a small or medium and juniors, medium to a large and junior. So, um, I'm hoping that fits her. <laughs> if not, I'll give it to my these two it's small. So the kimono romper is called kimono romper. It was originally fifty dollars. It was marked down twenty five or one anyway, so it was already half off. Yeah, the sticker said it was already marked down to twenty four ninety nine. Okay, <clears throat> this is before the final pricing. 80% uh, off took off another $20. Okay, so that brought down to $5 or $4.99. 30% off took off $1.50. 10% took off $0.35. Cents. My final price on this was $3.14. And it's nice quality and gorgeous. So hopefully this fits her up. I found a pair of jeans. I swear they hardly had any juniors. A lot of misses left, but hardly any juniors. She just had no your brands. And this is the sky rise highway high rise by jolt it is a size 7 or 28 waist which is genius um and these are just a nice pair of denim jeans look at that high waisted with the cheap sport you know so sage got a little rippage but you also got these studs and more rivets but these are like tasteful rippets but not like a picture well that one's a little cheap but it's fine and then got some nice pockets very like almost men's denim like the look and feel on the back they look really nice they kind of almost seem a little short which actually works like she's short <laughs> or shorter she's like five three and so these were already marked down to 24.99 let me tell you their jeans and goodies are expensive that was 50 percent off since so these are originally 50 dollars pair of jeans and the 80 percent off took 20 dollars off 30 percent off took a dollar 50 and then 10 percent took 350 335 so I paid 314 for these as well so same as the little kimono top please fit her I needed more clothes for her for her birthday her birthday is coming up um her birthday's in September so next up this wasn't marked down at all so I had no idea what it was see I was trying not to buy too much but also trying to make good purchases you, you just didn't know how much you were spending some of the stuff looks like kind of marked down kind of not marked down already and then you knew it was either 70 to 90 percent off so it's like okay in your head so this one wasn't showing marked down at all so this is a signature studio extra large 34.99 sleeveless cow neck is like warmish but not uber warm um but it's so cute and it's like asymmetrical bottom and it has the ties which i love okay it's 34.99 so not marked down to, down at all 
uh, 90% off though. So it took off $31.49, um, which what left $250? <laughs> I don't know, $350? Uh, 30% off took a dollar off, dollar oh five, and 10% extra took 24 cents off. So I paid two twenty one for this top, which is awesome. Next up, I get this for get this. I got this for my aunt. It's a two X um, from New Direction Women's. Um, it was already marked down twenty five percent, down to twenty two forty nine. It was originally twenty nine ninety nine, and this is big old cheetah print shirt which I think she'll love it's a little thin in the back okay so marked down it was already marked down seven dollars fifty cents which is 25 percent of the price then it was marked down 80 percent which took off 17.99 um then an extra 30 took off a dollar 35 the 10 percent took off 31 cents I paid two dollars and 84 cents for this top I caught me some flip flops, y'all. I needed some new flip flops. Like my flip flop situation is like, I went a couple are missing. My cat tore up a couple. He likes to really the spongy ones. He sometimes just it's not all the time. It's just every now and then he'll go in a frenzy and just play with my shoe. Just that shoe. Just those flip flops. And those flip flops are tend to be the ones that just go down into the laundry room anyway. But I thought these were so cute. They did have a lot of flip flops left. So um, these are from Delilah's. Which I think, remember, weren't they? The, I think it was the same daggum brand that used to be like the catalogs that you could order from when you were a teenager. Aren't they cute? Little pineapples <clears throat> and pink. And I just thought they were so adorable. And, like really nice, like like thick rubber, like actual rubber, not like the cheapo stuff anymore. So <clears throat> these were originally twelve ninety nine. I'm going to pay that. I buy, I buy the cheap. Okay, so $12.99, 60% off. They took off $7.79 for them. 10% took off $52. So I still pay $4.68, but honestly, they're a heavy flip-flop. They are a thick, thick, I can't bend them, thick flip-flop. So these are the ones that are meant to last. You know what I'm saying? More than a summer. Okay, I also could resist these. I wish they had black boots. I've been looking, well, these have more of a heel, but like, slightly less of a wedge heel and black is what I really want. I found a similar pair at Target but they're just like the same. It's the ones I freaking wore out that I've had for years. I mean I wore them so much the sole is like gone. <laughs> and they came from Kato's and I don't know and I can't find them anymore because they're they were a gladiator but a very bracketed gladiator and it was just gorgeous black shoes. Anyway these shoes right here from the brand Jessica Carlisle, I guess. And I figured out I wore, um, I tried on a 9 and a 10. The 10 weren't bad, it was just a little loose in where the heels at, like it didn't come close enough to where I would want them. And I knew that the more my foot moved around and they became looser, like my toe would probably, my pinky toe was just short, <laughs> really kind of short, um, would have clipped the edge. So I got the 9. And I just have to work them in a little bit, but they fit fine. Of course, these say they were forty dollars or forty dollars, maybe like twenty, twenty-five. And they were eighty percent off, which took off thirty-two oh one. Okay, thirty percent off took off two dollars and thirty-nine cents. Ten percent took off fifty-six. My final price is five dollars and four cents. And they're nice. They're they're pretty nice. That's like suede. They're nice. But this is like more like a um. A slick kind of looks like slicky leather but not suede so I think they're adorable and cute and I don't have like that color neutral sandal I always went for black or pewter or like a silver those are my colors <laughs> neutral sandals which I still love saying you think they were supposed to take off 30% but you know you can't really complain when you're getting such a bargain anyway but it didn't work or didn't go through on the phone thing even though they had signs and I didn't notice because these rang up first like they're at the beginning of my haul so anyway but I got a six piece towel set they had a few of these left just like a handful like four or five and um they're like they feel like microfiber and I just wanted to try them to see if they dry my hair fast I really don't know I mean I had a hair wrap thing which didn't seem to work but I wanted to try these 
Um, so I guess I got like two hand towels, two bath towels, and two washcloths in a very dull gray color. Um, I'm telling you, my, my towels are a mixture. Like I have, I have one turquoise left, but um, I have red, I have purple, like blood red, purple, and like a deep violet, and then um, black. I matched my curtain at one time. Oh, my curtain's so black. So $29.99. They took off 60%, which is $18. Then took off the 10%, took off $1.20, which brought them down to $10.79, which is not bad for what these are. I mean, they're plushy soft. <laughs> they feel like microfiber, so I'm interested in that. And heck, I don't really like them. My brother and his kid really need tell, so like. You know, I could pass them on to them if I don't like them. So, anyway, these, I was super excited about. I really liked them. A whole, like, silverware set. Now, I have enough silverware. I've had my silverware for years, and it's the cheapo silverware that came in the plastic um, thing you get at Walmart with the black plastic handles. <laughs> that's been my silverware, and I don't care. But I was like, oh, I saw these. I was like, oh, that's nice. They're, they're nice. And I was like, okay. I may have an extra few pieces and then, like, utensils are a whole other thing, but, or, like, serving utensils are a whole other thing. Um, that, that was my obsession for a while, so I <laughs> got all of those. But I figured I could replace mine with a set I like better and give those, I mean, they've held up this long, it's been, like, years, um, to my brother and them, but I don't really want to give them to him now because I don't know what's with them. Like, they buy silverware all the time, get silverware all the time, and it disappears. A lot of times the kids just freaking take it outside and leave it, or it gets lost in the couch or something like that. But I'm like, how do you lose all your silverware? Like, when my grandma died, my grandma had loads and loads of stainless steel silverware. Um, like, loads. And we let them all have it because we knew every piece of it was gone. So I'm like, how do you lose all your silverware? So I might wait until closer to, like, Thanksgiving when we need. I mean, I'll, like get it out of the drawer and like put it in a box or something and like put mine up like after I wash it but like hold off to like Thanksgiving or something when we'll need some silverware <laughs> I mean seriously they get silverware like it's like usually a present like <laughs> I don't know I'm like how can you not control the kids bring it back in like it's crazy alright anyway so this is really expensive silverware set for $39.99 it's from what, Euro Home I guess okay um it is a 20 piece with chrome caddy I guess that's why expensive but you got service support and stainless steel dishwasher safe the only thing my current set does not have that's in here is I don't have these longer forks I'm guessing they're dinner forks and these are technically salad forks yeah, salad forks. But then I really do. I didn't even notice that. So I was like, what do you think of that? And that these are like clear handles. I like that a lot. I think that's really pretty. So I might like be shoving for room for the longer forks, but whatever. Um, so anyway, even though these didn't mark down the extra 30% off for buying more than five items, which it's supposed to, the 60% off took off $24. So we're down to about $16.59. 10% took off $1.60. So my final price for these, really nice set. I mean, it's a really, really nice set. It's $14.39. And I'm like, that's nice. I, I love these handles. Like for something like when, you, when I first moved in, it was a struggle. I had like hand-me-down stuff. I had to buy certain stuff and didn't have like the most amount of money, but I needed to furnish my apartment. So you know, I just dealt, and so war was not the biggest priority of, like, hey, get something you like. My plate sets were, like, they were, like, within a year, I think, or so I had a new plate set or two. Like, I was like, me, 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 and we're getting a new plate set, and I got found a plate set I love. Took me a minute. And I think I had to go to a kitchen shop that they had in an outlet, but I bought me a plate set that I love. So. One other thing, but it was for my neighbor, and I just let her have it, because she's you know, just started back at school, and she's like, of course, I'm 14, 16, and she's only like 11, um, but I didn't realize how cheap her top came out, otherwise, I wouldn't, I might go back and see, they probably don't have anything else, 
um, and just save it because I didn't have really anything in my niece's size. That's what I was looking for. Um, so I had some little shorts and that was it. But that shirt that I got her was so cute. It was like blue and had a little pheasant top moment and it was made out of like not linen but like really sturdy cotton. I don't know what it was. Um, and it's like very pale, that pale pretty blue. Not this blue, but just like the solid pale blue, like sky blue almost. Um, <clears throat> and so I think it had a little embroidery on it. But that top says um, it was $24 originally. It took their marked down 90%. So it took off $21.60. 30% took off 72 10 percent took off 17 i paid a dollar 51 for that top i wish i had stuff in my community size i should have went earlier but i just kept putting it off putting it off putting it off and i'm like i should have went earlier and got some stuff so yeah here is my haul i think i did awesome total i spent 66 dollars yeah 66.42 is what i spent on all of this which i thought was pretty dang awesome so I got a Christmas gift. I got birthday gifts. I got me some stuff. <laughs> like I need more shoes. I did need more flip floppies. And you know what I can do with that Chrome Caddy? Because it's like divided brushes. Like, come on. Or something. Can hear brushes? Yes. <laughs> use something like that. I didn't even realize that until I was like just thinking it before I started filming. I was like, I can use that kind of brushes. It's awesome. All right. So thank you for watching. Like and subscribe. Toodles.